Full time here, the dock two, Bowes nil. Fox, disappointed tonight. What are your feelings after that? Very disappointed. They put in a good shift. They were giving it all, but they were just too slow. The Dundalk boys, they're the big fit lads. They're huge compared to some of the lads, the likes of Watts and Owen Stokes and Keith Ward when he came on. It was just unfair from the start. Yeah, you, you just have to look at uh, Pat Hooban up front and like the guy's an absolute tank and he, he was just, Monster. you know, he's just an absolute nightmare. And like even, even when he went with five at the back, he was still creating a lot of trouble there. He was a real aerial threat. Absolutely, That's, He was absolutely. winning everything in the air. And uh, I suppose the... Um, the early goal is a killer, really. Like when you're when you're up against a team that's probably fitter than you, probably no dis disrespect, just probably better footballing ability as well. An early goal like that is such a disappointment, really, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it started off a bit slow though, as well. Yeah, true, true. Um, I thought Dundalk kind of whizzed the ball around a bit, a bit too much, and you were kind of almost ch chasing shadows there for for large periods of the game. But to be fair, you know, hung on in and give it an effort. But it, it, I thought perhaps. A, a difference in class really and, and I suppose that's the level that you guys need to get to yeah it is just uh, I don't know it's just just disappointing night all around tonight, really yeah. yeah but look I suppose like your season's not going to be defined by games against the, the, the top two your Corks and your Dundalks they're probably going to go battle, head to head battle for the league but uh, you know <sighs> what can we say about the night and then any positives you can take out of the game uh, well, Dylan Watts started off really slow, but coming into the second half, he played a good few balls out to Keith Buckley, and Keith was swinging them in, so I was happy with those. Dinny Corcoran looked a real threat up front as well, with his touches and his flicks off. A real flair up there. I like him and Owen Stokes up, they played real well together, but sometimes Owen just got pushed off the ball too much. Yeah, there was definitely a, a, a big uh, difference in terms of physicality there. But at the same time, you know, I'm trying to think back of the game now, and I, I think of the one in the first half, for the ball where I was sure it was in, kind of flicked us across the goal line. Then you have Stokes and Watts one on ones in the second half there as well. You know, they're the things that you needed to go your way tonight, really, wasn't it? From the point where I thought it went in, I was looking at it from here where I'm standing. I thought it went in, and then Stokes one on one, he should have stuck that higher. He turned your man. He tried to place a bottom corner, but he really should have put his foot through it. And Dylan Watts, he tried to dink it over the keeper. Yeah, I know just, just uh, yeah, you know, against the keeper's experiences, Rogers, you know, you're gonna have to do a lot better. The really, keeper there. as good as him, it's just not going to work. He knew well what he was trying to do. He should have just put his foot through it where he was. True, but um, yeah, look, there we are. I suppose I've, I've given Evan a chance to think of positives from the game. I'll let, I'll let you finish here now. Oh. Any positives you can take, really? Well, yeah, started off second half very well, in my opinion, I think. And got robbed in the end with the end goal, in my opinion. So, but folks on the Dublin Derby next week. And Absolutely, yeah. Well, at, at least you have a massive, massive yeah. game to look look forward to. And, you know, it's the perfect perfect game to get a reaction against. And, well, look, there you are, folks. Uh, thanks very much for joining us, both. Thank you. Both. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the right, YouTube subscribe. channel, Irish Football Fan TV. We'll talk to you all soon, folks.